Attending Carolina has helped me become who I am. You know, this is where I, I've grown up. This is where I became a man. It's one of the best things I've made in my life. This family is what really separated it from any other school in the country. When I went to the university, my name was Mike Jordan. When I left, it was Michael Jordan. Jumper from out on the left, gone! You know, my roots were planted with my parents, but then the water got poured onto me for my growth at the University of North Carolina, and then after that, it just started to grow. Look at that! Holy cow! Growing up a Tar Heel fan, and I've always wanted to be able to play on that level, and coming here, looking up in the Raptors, and seeing all the jerseys up there, and you recognize some of the guys because they come back and they give you speeches. It's just an honor. I get chills today when I walk out on the court and I see my jersey up there. We respect one another because we all put on that jersey and it means something special for whoever puts on that jersey as well. It's a school of legends. You know, most nights you go out, somebody else on the other team is from Carolina or played at Carolina. You've seen them here in the summer, you've met them, and uh, just being able to see that throughout the league is unbelievable. It's something you have to be a part of. You know, for them to show me love and for me to show the same love back to them, I think guys on the outside kind of just don't really understand it. Since I've been in the league, that's all people ever talk about. They understand that we got something special going on here and highly respected around the league, for sure. You look at other schools, I mean, they have, they have the bright lights, they have great fan bases, but nobody has that, that family that we have, where it's, you know, everybody from where they played in the 50s or where they played last year that, you know, brings everyone together, and that's what makes Carolina special. Everything about the program transcends generations. So, to me, I feel, I still feel connected just by watching, knowing that these kids are gonna learn basically the same things that I learned. Playing at Smith Center is uh, one of the great experiences of my life. Now, when you run out and you see all that blue, there's no mistake in which shade of blue that is. Going out of the tunnel to see the crowd roaring, you know, I haven't experienced anything like it since, to be honest. It's a special feeling, one that I you know, have never forgotten. Just playing in the Dean Dome, playing in front of those great fans. I mean, we have, you know, some of the best fans in the NBA, but, uh, you know, it's not like these, you know, 20,000 that are here every single night. It's truly one of the great venues in all of sports. I enjoyed every time I stepped out on that floor. Every night from my freshman year to my last game, it was always amazing. You feel the electricity in the building. You know, there's 22,000 people screaming, standing up, jumping, going crazy. Uh, they're playing videos of Michael Jordan, Vince Carter, uh, all the greats, and you're just, you know, you're immersed in that situation. and You get to play in front of those people. Everybody, wants to play at Carolina, wants to beat Carolina, wants to, you know, be a part of this. So, uh, you know, this is where it happens. Working with the kids on the court, that's what I live for. That's what I think about before I go to bed at night is getting out on the court and then coaching the kids. Defense! Defense! And Coach Williams prepared me just by teaching me to do things the right way, you know, just little things that stuck with me and that I, I've taken with me to, you know, live my life as an adult. He taught me patience off the court, you know, not just on the court. Always striving for greatness, you know, never settling for anything but the best. And uh, I kind of take that mindset into anything I do. Well, he cares about us as people just as much as he does as players. He develops us uh, in our skills and our game, but at the end of the day, he cares more about us, you know, being ready for any aspect of life. We've been the best of friends, like a father-son relationship. Even to this day, you know, he still do things, you know, like he's my father. <laughs> Coach Williams prepared me to be a pro and just learn how to put it the right way. But bigger than that, prepared me for life. He probably got on me more than anybody else on the team, but I mean, I thank him for it, because I mean, he's taught me to be the man that I am today. The Tar Heels are the national dadgum champions. I want to win another national championship. And if we we're lucky enough to do it, I probably want to win another one. But that drives me every day to be the best program we can possibly be. And every day try to give those guys on my team something positive that they'll remember for the rest of their lives.